Yo, yo, Sam, you dig the new the new background, new backdrop? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, new background. Good. Background. Yeah, good, good start. Background. Uh, come on. Shout out to Natalie yeah. for painting this for me. It's pretty cool. It's more than just paint. It's got this dope stucco texture to make it look like brick. It's pretty dope. Yeah. I'm pretty stoked about it. I'd say it's a very a very pleasant, very nice upgrade. And look at that. Circa. Shout out. I wasn't gonna I, say I, it, Sam. I was just gonna yeah. Okay. Well, you don't have to address I forgot, everything. I forgot. The, you don't have to address I forgot everything. The sticker up too. But so, okay. So who's the beer? Well, yeah, yeah, I forgot the rest of the beer too. But anyways, what is that? The oh, flyby. Yeah, flyby. Yeah, shout out the flyby. They, they send us a uh, little uh, five pack, six yeah, pack dog. of some growlers. What up? What up? What Pretty up? Good. Yep. Episode one hundred and four. Something. Yeah. One hundred and four. Yeah. 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 One hundred and four, man. I don't. I can wear black now. Yo, I can wear yo, black. Could, not that this is black, but I can wear black now because the the background. I wear black all the time, and I'm. I'm like part of the background, so yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's that's one of the downfalls wearing black. Like it goes with everything except like not black walls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The one kryptonite you found it. Yeah, but you solved it. Yeah. Fucking again, shout out to Nally for this dope wall. So what's new, Sam? Anything? Uh, Anything at all? Nothing really too nothing. exciting. You know, Winter Olympics are coming up. <laughs> <laughs> like that matters. <laughs> no, Winter Olympics all. suck, dude. I, yeah. Yeah. Especially when like half it's like not exciting. Like especially like the hockey and stuff, like the the actual like pro like NHL players can't compete in the Olympics. So you're already they not can't? having like no, they're not allowed. They're not oh. I thought like if you're in the NHL, if you're playing like other since, leagues. Is that new? Yeah. I was gonna say Melbourne I remember recently. playing like uh fucking NHL and Team Canada and shit had Oh yeah, players. It's only like pretty recently. Yeah, I thought so. Soccer always did that. Like soccer, you could only have like one or two superstars or something like that. I don't know what the technical rule yeah. of that was, but hopefully yeah. this mic is. Yeah, it's all good. Yeah, yeah. levels seem okay. We're doing yeah. so, so doing good so far. Sure. I mean, the past See, few episodes we've worked around some ever, difficult difficulties. Do you ever but, eat food? Yes, I eat food. And while you're chewing it, yep. you think about it in your mouth. Yeah. Yeah yeah, 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 you know, I know what, what I mean? You mean. Yeah, yeah. What were you eating that brought oh, this idea to? Oh, shit. You that? I don't know. I forget. Either way, it might have been cereal. Okay, but it's just like, yeah. Sometimes you does it ever turn you off of what you're eating? Um, like sometimes you just like imagine it too hard about what it looks like in your mouth, and you're just like, ah, oh, shit. Like, no, it probably doesn't look that good. Because I, it always ends up. You know, for like me, when someone does this, my later train of thought through that whole thing is like. How does all my food become poop? Like, oh like how does God. all of this get down to fucking the end result? <laughs> like, all this stuff gets brown up question. and comes like this. Like, that's a good same question. thing every time. You know what? Time, it's but you not know, you one. Know what I mean. It's not one I want to hear the answer. No, because like, it's way too boring and drawn out and technical. If I knew someone who was like fully educated on that, like, I guess maybe I guess it would still be boring. I'm yeah, like, they'd be like, well, it has to be broken. Well, you down. see, when it goes to the stomach, the asses yeah. do this. I'm like, okay, no, someone no, just needs to break like, it down. Magic school bus. Break it down for like a sentence. Go watch magic school bus. Yeah. Well, I already have. Actually, remember you that was refresher. one of like our third or fourth episodes, like the yes. Magic Talking School Bus episode. Arnold. Yeah, committing taking suicide. His, yeah, taking his helmet off. Yeah, yeah, crazy man. Yeah. That I'll was, never that forget was a it. Couple years ago, already. Yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. hundred. Like I'm getting more and more used to the new set. Uh, it's definitely coming around, man. Yeah, shout out to uh, we did it. I already shouted them out once. Oh, that I'm went down the wrong way. Already slouching a bit. Oh, down the wrong way. Yeah. Oh my God, you ever have I'm that? slouching. Yep. Oh. Yeah, know what you mean. Know exactly what you mean. But I think what you you were going to be saying is that um, we, there we go. shut out a podcast before, and then yeah. Matt interacted with said podcast, Money Buys Happiness. Why do you have to say it like that? I said podcast. Why are you, he interacted with interacted. The, Like, what are you? I'm an influencer, Are you a robot? Bro. I am an influencer. Are you a robot? The algorithm. <laughs> I am the, in the algorithm. No, okay. Money Buys Happiness podcast. Dope. I, they asked a question on their Instagram. I've interacted with them a couple of times. They're, they're dope guys. You've but. interacted. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck. <laughs> Damn it. Um, but no, I asked them a question about how we could get more guests, and they were they're totally right. Me and Sam have said it a thousand times. We need to put out clips more often, so we're pumping more clips out. Yep. Forgot to tell you, Sam, I threw another one in the drive today. So Fucking right. Yeah, dog. All right. All right. Cool, cool. Yep. Cool, cool. Well, shout more. out to Money Buys Happiness Podcast. Go check them out. They're dope. Cool guys. Um, yep. Exactly what we needed to hear. You know, it was, it was a good thing. I had another food thing. What people was flavor. it? Uh, people flavor. People <laughs> flavor. So that's, that's like, all right, it's so like people can already play or something. All right, cool. Yeah, see, we, we already did so it. So I feel like as we dumb as our name is, we sometimes did I'm like, we did it. 
Yeah, I feel like there's something there. Fuck I, yeah. I still feel like there's something People here, man. There. Um, so, I have this theory that I made up in the car one day. Okay. I think I one might of the best have, places to think as well, I feel like, as well. I was in the passenger seat, too, so. Okay. True. Serious thinking. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. None <laughs> of that. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, That's it. You, know, you know. Yeah. None of that is fucking <laughs> side mirror checks. Um, okay, so if you were a chef, okay. you know how, oh, sorry, you know how like you have tr- trouble figuring out what you want to eat for dinner sometimes? Yeah. You know how you're yeah, always yeah. like, I don't. The struggle. Even like anyone like doesn't know what they want to eat sometimes. Personal problems. I mean, I guess. <laughs> but do you think like what makes a chef like a really good chef is knowing what they want? You know what I mean? Because like. Do you think part of being a good chef is being able can, to make that decision a lot better? Like I can, I can, I can ponder what do I fucking feel like right now, and not even eat sometimes. You know, like you get to the point where you're just like fuck it. <laughs> but like, do you think a chef is just like I want this, and they're just like, Pfft. you know, I really feel it, like this. I'm gonna do it. I, I can see where you're going with this, and I feel like it's something that it's kind of like. Beauty has art as well and stuff too. Like okay. you can look at it in that uh, lane as well. Like if you want to sign music, you kind of make what you almost want it here in a way, right? So you almost want to like make your food how you want it, like even yeah, yeah, what yeah. you what your taste buds are feeling, you know. But I mean more so that ability to make that decision, the right decision do all the think, time. Do you think a really good chef even ponders what do I feel like right now for like more than five ten minutes? I think sometimes maybe they just buy like bulk of stuff so they all just have stuff to like make there well, or, or like it yeah, depends the course. process. Maybe they just go like the local markets and just go like, oh, oh that's interesting. I'll try they that. They definitely and do just that. just fucking just whip up They stuff. definitely do that. Yeah, man. Because even like, no, it's like snack. Like how much is like a really good chef just want to eat like a bag of chips? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's instead, a good question instead, too. Instead of making like, oh, I'm gonna make some fucking uh, some brownie parfait. Or yeah, you think like Gordon Ramsay just yeah. like fucks ketchup chips. Yeah, right. <laughs> like, because you can't get those in the states, really. No, that's a Canadian thing, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Yeah, that and all dressed. Yeah, yeah. All dressies, they're dope. All dressies. You don't like ketchup, eh? I'm not the biggest fan of them. No, I liked them when I was younger. Because I would, I kept. I would say ketchup nah. chips are better than all dressed. But. Yeah, all dressed are better. That's neither here nor there. Sure. Okay. Whatever. Anyways, but it would be funny if chefs, like, it's almost like an act. They're like, they say they're making all this food, but they actually, like, you see them at McDonald's and shit all the time or something. <laughs> yeah, like they, <laughs> well, I mean, I could, people have their guilty pr- pleasures. I definitely have heard, like, you know, people have, people have, like, weird soft spots for fucking, like, Big Macs yeah. and stuff like that, right? Yeah. Well, th- I guess then again, too, it's the same like any profession or something that's like, you know, it's like a again a musician or a football player. Like, do a football thing right now. You're not you're not a football player 100 percent of the time, but you're not a chef 100 percent of the time. Sure. Like, you kind of when you want to be. It's almost like a like treat it as like camping or something like that. You can be really good at like camping, hiking, stuff like that, but you just can't do it all the time. Like, it's like a chef, like, like making food yeah, all the time. Yeah, you're not yeah. making 100 percent of your day is not made up of making <laughs> yeah, food. Yeah, you're just like, right? what am I gonna make now? Yeah, what like, am I gonna make now? <laughs> yeah. What you're am just I gonna make? A succession of stuff. I just, just made like French toast. You turn on now what am I going to make? I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. I feel that. Same might be like a creative process. Might turn it off for a bit to fucking fuck off and just watch something or whatever. Sure. Like, you know. Do you think they watch cooking shows? <laughs> <laughs> probably. Uh, maybe not. They probably just know the actual chef. So they actually probably just know how they already are anyway. That's a good point, like, oh, too. I've been to his restaurant. He, he cooks an okay salmon. That's a good point, too. Um, <laughs> I had this idea about... A- <laughs> Like, I tap on the grocery cart all the time. Yeah, this is where I, I feel like that idea was going with you. <laughs> yeah, like, even like even more with Enzo now, like with because I'll, like, have fun with him and stuff. But, like, I thought it would be funny to rig up, like, a drum kit on a grocery cart that you could bring with you to the grocery store. And just, like, <laughs> fucking, so you just walk through the grocery store, like, <laughs> yeah, that, like you could like a like, clamp to go on like the one handle for like your fucking like hi hat or yeah something, yeah like you could symbol. just like I bet someone can rig that up real easy yeah I, and make it just like yeah make something that like a Walmart could sell like oh you buy this here you can yeah, like, yeah 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 
Exactly. Or you, you can buy these cars with the drum kits on, or you can buy these cars. <laughs> yeah, you know, this car has a drum kit. Yeah, or this car has something else. The on best it. part would be like someone. Just probably make like a tablet or something on a cart. It's always be like in there. You'd be like, oh, I'll do this while you're shopping, or like yeah, yeah. tell you where to find shit or something like an interactive thing. Yeah, like a, like at the library. Fucking, you got the uh, just at Dewey the library decimal system. You got a Dewey Decimal System on your grocery cart. Oh fuck. You know? Like, where's the bananas? It's I, like, oh, fucking I Dewey Decimal it up. We can say how probably how old we are. Like, li- yeah, a library like, what Dewey Decimal. Dewey Decimal. Dewey Decimal. I haven't Decimal heard system? that in fucking, like, 20 years. Man. Yeah, Dewey Decimal System. I don't even remember how it works. Do you remember how it works? I just know I'm old enough to know that, that what that was. I guess, like, what, did they assign categories to numbers? Like Because there were so many. Deal. It's just a way of, like, organizing, like, like, A1, A2, or something like that, wasn't it? No. The, 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 like how you organize all the books and different. Well, that, yeah, it's how you organize the books. Yeah. Should we look it up? Like, like, like the coding of it, if you want to call it that. Not how the coding. fuck do you spell Dewey Decimal? Oh, okay, well, Decimal System is pretty straightforward. Yeah, Decimal System, yeah. But, but like Dewey, Dewey Decimal Dewey, System. Dewey from like, was it Mach 1 right. in the middle? What, what do you got? It, what is it? Yeah, like it's, they numberize. Numberize? They numberize <laughs> categories. That's it. Like fucking. Okay. Like, nailed God it. damn it. <laughs> Fucking nailed it. Why well, don't we, we just use that I nowadays? got it, guys. Instead of using letters, we're going to use numbers. I get that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but they're already thinking of the algorithm. You know, the algorithm is just a bunch of numbers crunched yeah, together. A like, bunch, whatever, of, bunch right. of data being analyzed. Yeah. You know? Um, yeah. You know what? As some thought is that, like, I know a lot of people like the Beatles. But some people treat the Beatles that they're like, the they fucking like made music. Like they're just like the fucking, ba- I sure like their numbers talk and just that and the other, but like, yeah, there were other bands around that people weren't just listening. Like again, are people still talking about the Beatles? Like I mean, they kind of are. Like, like no one our age is. At this point now it's because they're still alive in a way. Like sure they've done other, like stuff, but I mean. Two of them are. Yeah. Yeah. Two? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, but I, I just feel like the people like all the, they still like the, you know, the classic yeah, Abbey Road like, shirt. And I like guess the plain Beatles T-shirts and stuff like that. Pe- yeah, like do you mean their music that itself or the what they've done? I because I feel like what they've done and what they did. Yeah, what, what they've done culture is all like for like music business and everything else. I'm but was massive. Like I, I learned about both of us learned about that. We went to and school. obviously, if you grew up in those times, it must have been pretty revolutionary. Yeah, but I'm sure and there I think was other was, people trying other similar that, shit to that, right? Yes and no. See, all I think a lot of that was also tied to how technology changed with them because it was all like, you know, amplifiers became a thing, and then like studio th- became a thing and then using the studio as an instrument became a really big thing because they they got to the point where they couldn't tour anymore basically because the crowds were too loud yeah yeah like they right. even, yeah. It, it didn't it was too loud for them they couldn't hear themselves the audience couldn't hear which is fucking insane yeah like it's insane so there was literally no point on them touring <laughs> Yeah, so they just hung out in the studio. Yeah, like, so Maybe they just shit. fucking wrote in the studio. Yeah, they lived like, in the studios. Like, I'm not, like, denying, like... I'm their, not saying they didn't talent. tour. They did tour, but they the, at one point, they barely could. There's yeah. no point. Again, like, like, they made a big impact culture and stuff like that, but I feel like it's just, like... I'm not a, I'm not a huge fan of the They're music. one of many bands who have changed the industry and made, you know... They do have the odd generational song music that, like, and shit. surprises me. Because, like, obviously there's the old, like, just, like, the fucking hunky-dory Beatles songs that are all, like, yeah. do, 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 revolution. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Yeah, like, yeah. Shake it on, baby. Now. Twist and mm-hmm. Twist That's a good song. And but, uh, the Rocky Raccoon, that's my favorite Beatles song. Do you even know it? No. Fuck, man. See, no. that's the song you might like. I feel like you've shown me that song before. It sounds familiar. But you just said no, so. Well. I, I didn't know, but then remember you showed me a while ago. My my, my memory's getting fucking worse and worse. <laughs> like it, it, it's getting more hey, and more foggy. I guess so. That's Sam getting older, or yeah. Sam having a brain tumor. <laughs> hopefully, <laughs> hopefully not one of those. <laughs> but you know, let's see where life takes me here. You know. Yeah. 
Living the dream, yeah, oh, bro. Living um, the dream. Fuck, what was the what, other What do you got? I forget now. Oh, forget? Dude, what? Well, there's so many sports. Okay. I don't know if we've talked about this before, but yeah. there's so many like sports or like games, like just like lawn games and backyard games and whatever, yeah. games that you wouldn't consider sports, that just involve like getting close to something. Yeah, they're just dressing up something very, very simple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like me and you could grab those two cans, pick an object, and be like, closest one gets the point. And there's a yard game. <laughs> it, yeah, man. I feel like it's something that's so... Lawn like, darts, like, closest to. Like bocce ball. Primal. Closest to. Like just something so primal as being like the A. Washer toss. Challenging somebody to something. And then... Curling. Yeah. Again, probably just two dumb idiots like us being like, hey, I... Yeah, exactly. Who, who can throw this rock farther? Yeah. Okay. Who, yeah. who can fucking sharpen a better fucking stick? Or like... Well, that game sounds dumb interesting. Shit. Right? Who can sharpen a stick better? I like that. Yeah. It's just different dumb that's competition like that. <laughs> right? Revolutionary tasking. Dude, that's Imagine fun. doing that in the metaverse. <laughs> Sharpening sticks in the metaverse? Yeah. Bro, we're on to something. Right? Some, you sharpen your own stick is you know, and your stick's your NFT. Yeah. And you can roast marshmallows with it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. Fucking. That's the only thing I've ever fucking sharpened a stick for. Really? I did. What else have you sharpened a stick for? Man. Were you spear fishing? <laughs> Funny you ask that. <laughs> I was with my friends in Alaska. <laughs> you were spearfishing in Alaska. <laughs> oh, man. Now, you forgot to tell you this? You didn't know it's summer of 2016? It's probably so cold. <laughs> I, I, went, I went for you the summer. You spearfish in Alaska. I went for the summer in 2016, man. You Nobody is spearfishing in Alaska. <laughs> Who? Really? Well, I mean, I shouldn't say that. You're not in the know, <laughs> you... Fucking prick! You're not wrong. Hey there, pal. You need I'm to know your the, role the spear on the no. spearfishing community, especially in Alaska, of all places. Yo, Alaska we have to find the it. pinnacle. We have to find it. The spearfishing if community. people spearfish in Alaska, <laughs> it happens. Comment below if you've ever been spearfishing in Alaska. If so, come on the podcast. <laughs> yeah, that'd be fun. I want to hear your stories. Up better yet, go Alaska. on Rogan. <laughs> yeah. That'd be yeah, fun. Sure. Like, no, nah, well, Rogan. Ooh, he might be canceled. Yeah, you said the, the trigger word, man. Fuck, we keep getting canceled every goddamn episode here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I forgot. And then, you know what, man? We have, do we have more plays now than- Keep um, on rocking if you boosted. <laughs> yeah, do we have more viewers shout on Spotify than Neil Young cast. right now? Shout out to the boys cast. Yeah, shout um, out to us. Then Neil Young? Is Neil Young off Yeah, Spotify? you're right. We got more <laughs> listeners than Neil Young yeah. right now. Fuck. Fuck yeah. We're making it, bro. Let's yeah, fucking go. Let's go. We're passing a Canadian. And party. Joni Mitchell. Oh, it's cool. Apparently she's done blackface before. Really? Yeah. That didn't change my life whatsoever. Okay. Oh, <laughs> 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 I, I mean, if the leaders are doing it. I mean, well, if Joni Mitchell can do it too. I mean, yep, that too. And then every leader is just getting like under fire. It was a different feel. time. So. Different time? Okay. Is that the only thing they get away with saying? I mean, it kind of just gets shoved under the rug, I feel like. I, you know, we're all younger. We make mistakes when we're younger. Did we, though? I didn't do that. Some <laughs> did. Some did some dumb shit. I did, I did some dumb shit when I was younger. Not like that. Not like that. Yeah. No, but I, others still... If you translated what I Sounds did... Sounds like you're equating it to that. If if you translated maybe what I did in other places to this event, you know... All right. Might be somewhere I don't know what close. You're saying. Okay. Sam, you know mental health's a big topic. Always is, man. Yeah. Sounds like we're doing a sponsor ad. Yeah. That sounded like we were going straight into an ad. Sure. All right. Um, what does that be as role? Then? Let's go. Um, I've been seeing a lot of people on Instagram. I shouldn't say a lot of people, like fucking... Look at all the thousands of people. But fucking, they're posting going for a walk. Like they're going for a walk, but they're calling it mental health walks. Okay. And I'm like, bitch, you're just walking. <laughs> yeah. Again, how you're all saying really how sports is like some sports are getting closest to the thing. Yeah. You're still, you're dressing up something very, very simple. You are walking. <laughs> right, right. You're walking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, a, a, not to sound like an asshole, but like any like cancer walk or something like that. Like Mental health coke. You're walking. Hey? Eh? You're walking. This is for my mental health. 
Yeah, you can always say that, you know. Like the it's not for my other health. Bitcoin's for my mental it's health. It's not for my other health. Your other health? I don't know. Maybe it's your uh fucking physical health? Non mental health. Psych health? Or spiritual. Spirit that's what I was going for. I yeah. feel like that's the same thing. Who are you to say that? Is it? Who said we're not allowed to have spirit animals anymore? I forget. Uh, who, uh, people who I shouldn't really take their opinion seriously for? <laughs> well, that's fair. I like that. I like that answer. Yeah, I like that answer. Because like a spirit animal, it's just like, it, it, it's not a thing. It's stupid. It's, it's not a thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's not a not thing. It's just, it's I know it's a thing, it but you like. You have spirit anything. It's almost, yeah, it's, it's What's like, your spirit taco flavor? It's like, oh my God, Will Ferrell is my spirit animal. And people say it dumb like that. It's like, it's it's, like he's a person that's stupid. for one thing. That's just a person that you, instead of saying no, spirit animal, you're just saying like something I, less like an intelligent. Actual animal, at Again, least. I was telling you, something very similar, just dressing it up with a bunch of dumb shit. Around. Yeah, it's like how you're feeling right now. How I'm feeling right now yeah. is that thing is my spirit animal. Yeah. Mood. Yeah. Mood right <laughs> mood. now. Hashtag mood. Like, off. Oh, yeah, yeah. Because I'm, I'm, sometimes, like, okay, yeah, I, I get it, but like, are you though? Yeah. Really though? I'm getting comfortable. You're getting comfortable? Yeah, getting You're posting comfortable. up? Fuck yeah. yeah. Yeah, dude. Fuck yeah. Yeah, I'm getting more and more used to this chair too. I'm, I kind of miss I'm the getting old, lower today. I kind of miss the old fucking in the. Should we talk about the truckers, the Sam, now? real quick? Truckers? All right, we're, we've already been canceled earlier in the episode. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I, I, I mean, if anyone's made it this far, they're wondering what we think about the truckers. Yeah. All right, mother truckers, let's go. All right, you first. Truck, yeah. Okay, so I feel actually like- that's a funny. Before you go off, um, do you remember Monster Truck the band? They had the shirts. Don't fuck with the truck. Yeah, when I was play- like, yo, yeah. when they played in their fucking Who's- local library. Speaking of libraries make, earlier, if you wanted to make a thousand dollars. Last time I was at a library. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much, I might have went to the one in college, but even then, I was like, what's a library in college? Um, yeah. Actually, I don't think I did. That's a century of college. I don't think I did. I think I had to print something once. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways. Are you saying something about bon- uh, monster truck? Yeah, like if you wanted to make a thousand dollars right now, you'd go to Ottawa and sell "Don't fuck with the truck" shirts or "Don't fuck with trucks" or something along that lines. Easy. There's a thousand dollars for you right now. Anyone who's struggling, yeah, go spend the money, print yourself some shirts. Make you could probably even put mark fuck. up a bit more for yourself for whatever profit you want. You probably you put the, the trucks. Fuck, and you'll make a thousand dollars in a day. Fucking trucks, trucking. Your fucks to Tru- Parliament. So, what do you think, Sam? What do you think's going on? Playing with the truckers, man. You know what? Don't, you don't have to make it all bullshitty and uh, PR statementy. Just fucking. No, what do you is, think? What do you got? A bit of overreaction. A bit of makes like it kind of makes sense right now. It's just it's it's like again microcosm of what I'll say. Our culture and like everything is right now. But it's just like no matter what we fucking do. There's either either side, people caught in the middle, and people just fucking yelling at each other. Oh yeah, and it's goddamn annoying because it's it's we we have to pay attention to this shit most of the time. Sometimes depending on what said topic is, but like anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just almost fucking anything that's because things are always just gonna be controversial and like want to say political or right. you, tying into other causes and. Whatever, yeah, you like people call it. will find a way to, yeah, make things it. always being intertwined somehow. And la- yeah, a bunch like, of people layers insist to on like labeling it's people, it's never left taken or right. just strictly yeah. at base value. People always think there's underlying themes, and sometimes yeah. a lot of times there might be. I don't know all everything, sure. I just feel like it again, blown up a portion. We should just kind of see what other countries are doing, they're in support of what we're doing too yeah, in, yeah. in that way too and to see other countries are doing also with the mandates and stuff like that like can we kind of start trying something new yeah because the I think we're seeing that a little bit the, anyway the definition of what insanity is just doing the same thing over and over and over again like we've done lockdowns we've done distancing everything else did like, you see that study can we try something out? else new that's not in like us being locked down like can we try something of us trying to like be a part of society again. Yeah, yeah. Like get shit going. Yeah, like I think most people are willing to at least like open up at this point and, and like, just kind of see what happens. Yeah, and that's me speaking from like, like I don't have like a family to yeah, provide yeah. for. I don't have like other kids who are like missing out on childhood What's opportunities and random shit. What's like, that cage then? 
A cage? Oh, that was for our, 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 our next podcast guest. It's going to be in the, in the... Just in a cage. Yeah, they'll be in the rage cage. That'd be fun, actually. Um, did you see that study that came out that said like lockdowns were like 0.2% effective on... Or something? And it's like, I think they did a little more damage than good. Yeah, it was just going... <laughs> like, imagine we never locked it down. And only 0.2% more people died, but... If we None never, of the repercussions from locking down happens. It just happened on. Let's it, not think about that. It just happened. Let's not think about that. No, that that's too forward thinking. That's, that's way too depressing to think about. You know all the. Oh, also the best part will be the best part will be like the radical left trying to be like. No, no. You know no, how no, people's no, lives no. are going to change <laughs> if you didn't do that? How yeah, all, yeah. All the damage done now, you think that's for nothing now? Yeah, yeah. It's like, yeah they're going to oh. be like, actually, what they really meant by the 0.2 was a 98% increase of this over. Th- <laughs> yeah. <laughs> really means that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They always yeah. rationalize it to be like, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And the right's always like to like brash about what they're doing or something or yeah 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 fucking support this like I thought what was the person who would think that the truckers like is being funded by and started by like some girl who's part of like yeah yeah some was white like Jeff I want to say some king some guy named King last name King I don't know I want to say sure anyway I don't know like he's uh, I didn't look too much into that because I was just like yeah like the rights people nice who they look up to are like neo-nazis and shit like that but yeah, again yeah, yeah. some of the people top people on the left they're fucking like corrupt like whether they end or like pet like pedophilia yeah. like each side has their fucking big names who have been caught and doing greasy shit <laughs> yeah so well, that's the like, name of the game that's the name of the game so like so people you put more or less like champions sometimes they're doing just a bit different worse shit than what that side's doing yeah yeah like but it's still bad. Like, uh, yeah, like if that makes here, sense. Here's my, my two scatterbrained cents. Here. Here's my two cents. You, you know that, like, we interviewed some protesters, we interviewed some businesses, and like, honestly, at least locally, most people are on the same page. Yeah. They want. They I don't. Knew th- one of the guys you interviewed. They don't think like they are responsible for people at this point. Nor do I. Nor I don't think you do either. Like everyone should be responsible for themselves. Um, if you're scared, if you're someone who's compromise or whatever yeah. it's like you're the one that needs to be taking the extra precautions really um but the truckers man the truckers it's pretty interesting i mean the one thing is funny about the people that live in ottawa getting all riled up being like oh my god it's disrupting our lives meanwhile they're just like you know like our lives everyone's lives have been disrupted pretty bad yeah like you there's the thing about living in the city people live in the city uh because there's access to things, right? You you go to the city because there's access to things. You can get to a lot of things easily, yep. right? Yeah. There's like that's why the city is the city. It's accessible. Um, so it's and like we don't have that here, right? Especially like where I live. Like I can't. No. No. Yeah. No. We're some small town country boys. So like it, you can understand how easily it is for someone yeah. who lives with all this accessibility to all of a sudden go, Ooh, oh, I don't have all this accessibility anymore. I can't walk to my favorite yeah, said yeah. thing and get It's like, thing. A, you guys were in lockdown forever already. Like, what's a week or two in your apartment? Yeah, you don't even have to stay in your apartment, but I'm just using it Yeah, because that's what they were doing before when we were in lockdown. Yeah, because like, yeah, sure, from being there, like, Ottawa is actually a decent place to enjoy in the wintertime. <laughs> and the, I, and, I don't right. even really. Yeah, I, I, I don't even mean. really want to entertain the, the whole shit. Yeah, I don't even want to entertain the whole racist Nazi, whatever, because it's all their their doings of just trying to distort the narrative. Again, it's just they, it did way worse than it did good. It, no doubt. I just think it's, it's what things that you qualify for either cause for either cause are bigger than you that you don't like or barely than you that you do like. It's not even that, man. It's it's how quickly everyone just jumped the trigger. Imagine you had a gun in your hand and that's what you did. You know, like everyone was just boom 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 boom. Like that's not 
right? Yeah. Like everyone Words got can be everyone like that is sometimes, so Matt. everyone is so trigger happy. They're just like, oh, it's racist. Tweet. It's racist. Tweet. Tell your friends. Tweet. It's racist. And it's just like this isn't how it works. This isn't how it works. One person doesn't just get to say it's racist and then it's racist. No, it's like like. That's the Nobody beauty. was thinking about all the people that just support the cause that yeah. was ending the mandates. It's like the ending be- mandates. Like the beauty in like this is so, so deep. Like the beauty in like our flaws as human beings that like sure. everybody can like yeah, yeah, yeah. be different, have different opinions That's on about, things. They're all tweeting like, it from their iPhones made from children in China. So it's like okay. Like yeah. like, it, again, to your point though. There's so, again so right, much other things we can be doing as a society. If we have this much like influence and nicely power and like things of, like talking about these big subjects right now, if we apply that to like like fixing things, the different things in the world without bickering at each other the entire fucking time. Exactly. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it's mo- so much further. Common ground always We're needs so far to be as a society, met. but like oh. like everyone needs to find common ground to to learn how to agree or disagree. Or like, if you don't agree with each other, like, I'm not saying like, go to fucking like a lot of gladiator ring, but like, go somewhere. You should go to a gladiator ring. Where you can either, like, there should be something not instituted where like, go learn from both sides or have like, like a fucking. No, okay. You're talking about having a conversation. Like, like, like a conversation, need, like, like, like an out. None of these people went. You're so like, follow like an people, app. All the people that were in uproar about the truckers never went and talked to them. Never went down to the, they never talked to them. All the people that are in uproar about Joe Rogan don't listen to Joe Rogan, right? Like it's, this is it. So the second you want to put your ego aside and go actually to the ground floor of these things and put put yourself out of your own comfort zone, yeah. you'll be able to see a different perspective. Now, but you weren't at the BLM. You protest, don't have to go so. there going to but you already assume disagree people have done or these agree. things for other causes. No, some people here, have that here, pretense. Here, listen, as well. listen, listen. So it's like, you don't have to go to these places to agree or disagree, but you need to do what you need to do is go and expect to find some common ground with these people because you do have common ground. That's the first thing you should do. It's like well, you're both. Isn't that so super like hypocritical? Because like no, no, I'm saying like the person who are mad at people for doing this thing, um, but you do the same said thing for other causes you like. So it's just like that's not what I said. I'm not, not sorry. I, I was thinking something else. So I, like I'm, sa- I'm saying, that. like if someone, if you genuinely did want to change your mind, genuinely did want to have yeah. uh, an open mind, you wouldn't not go talk to these people, right? Like the answer is so clear. So many people were like so unclear about the cause of the truckers. It's like, yo, go onto the app, ask the truckers. That's all you had to do. If you were someone who was genuinely curious. That's all you had to do. But yeah. they didn't want to do that. Spread mis- misinformation. <clears throat> they just wanted to tweet. Misinformation. Blah, blah, blah. They're not real people on there. I had someone on my Facebook tweet like, can someone tell me why it isn't totally stupid? <laughs> and it's just like, that's not a real question. You just want someone to rah-rah you. And it got like 400 comments, bro. Yeah. <laughs> and he deleted it. And it's just like, this, is, this isn't how you work. So speaking of something that you know, Facebook, and you like, I saw I came up my timeline today. Like you like corrected somebody when they were like um, commented on one, like somebody else's somebody commented on your thing. Oh yeah, yeah. And then yeah, you yeah. commented back, and it was like a night like comes like a zinger. It's just like <laughs> it like, wasn't nice. even though. Like it was just like, what are you doing? Yeah, <laughs> it's just like this isn't the place for this. No, um, but yeah, like going back to that, it's all all these people don't go to the source. They don't want to find out the answers. And you have to, when you go do that, you will find common ground. And you don't have to go into that finding the common ground and agreeing with them. You can still disagree with them, but you'll find when you find the common ground, you will at least have, you will sympathize more and yeah. empathize more. For those yeah, people, it's just like the villain. As, will, as they will with you. Yeah, it's like the villainizing of If you want itself. them to do that to you, you have to do that to them. It's the only way. There's no other way. Otherwise, people are just yelling and yelling from the rooftops or yelling into their echo chambers, however you want to fucking analogy it. Yeah. What I uh, insert said analogy here about that. Because, yeah, it's. Because I just died. They're just protesting so much... to end mandates. Like, there's nothing else you really need to know. Yeah. Because, like, I, uh, at my work, like, I see the trucker that comes in and drops off our skids every yeah. day. Actually, today, as I'm filming, I 
you know, tomorrow is his last day. I'll see him because we're getting a new truck for our new Superstore okay. ship. Oh, yeah. yeah. Um, but yeah, he was, he went to the protest because um, like Ozzy Trucker, he's all, all for it and sure. stuff. And um, and he's vaccinated too. It's so like he's not like anti vax or anything too, right? None of them are. Yeah, right? I know. This I, is I, an anti- I'm, yeah. I'm, 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 I'm the only reason they're getting, they the only the reason they're getting away with still calling them anti vax is because they changed the definition earlier this year, last year to anti vax means against yeah. mandates. Yeah. So that's the only reason any article or news, whatever, is getting away with using the words anti vax. Yeah. I know. I, I Otherwise, just, it wouldn't be the correct. I was just going to be addressing like all the. Um, yeah, yeah. No, I know. Storylines as I go through this little um, anecdote yeah. I'm about to tell, if you want to call it that. Sure. Um, so the truck driver, he went up there. He, they brought food and everything, but they said, like, everybody else brought food and they were, like, talking to each other. Like, it's like any nationality, anything you want to see yeah. was there, too. It wasn't the fucking all white shit yeah, that people no. were saying, too, debunking that. Like, there and were so many posts. There was just, like, that. I forget what, whatever the Every, war, what monument yeah, downtown that was being, like, yeah. desecrated. There was a video that someone was, like, same bunch of, of dumb course. shit in front of it. But he, he literally showed me a picture on his phone. It was like, there were people just in a circle, like, kneeling, like, praying around and, like, just paying their respects. You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah. So it was just like, that debunks that thing. It's not like people were like, you know, yeah, was yeah. it? Um, I'll say monster size. That's the wrong word for it. Um, there's a Demonized? Something like that. Like, vilified? Desecrating or something like that. Oh, of the, oh, monument, the monument. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. I thought you meant the people. Yeah, so that debunks that thing, yeah. and yeah, so it was, but for a lot of protests, um, there's usually like washrooms provided, like porta potties and shit like oh, that. Oh yeah, but the city he, he didn't would, provide. He it. was saying that there were none there, not at the time lockdown, so a lot of some businesses are closed, so people can't go in and use the washroom. Right. So like, he said there was a preg- he actually saw it. There was a pregnant woman, and like yeah, apparently I guess pregnant had to pee a lot or some shit, but yeah. like she had to go to the washroom, and like like a bunch of guys just like stood with their backs like to her. Around her. Oh, really? And she and just peed. She just peed outside because wow. like there was nowhere she could go. Well, the, everyone will say that's her fault, right? So yeah, like, again, her fault and like all those guys around her, per the you know, yeah, doing yeah, yeah. shit, right? I mean, the w- the one part I thought was funny is how like people would post something that like, oh, just if a Nazi flag showed up there, everyone should be like, wow, this isn't where I need to be, or whatever like that. Meanwhile, it was like uh, they paid that guy to go there, and his face was completely fucking covered, and. Yeah. They fucking booed him the fuck out of there. They were like, "Get the fuck out of here." <laughs> Why do you be playing? And those- do you think they just made? Do you think they just made a couple of really high quality flags? You know, they just made a couple of really dope flags. <laughs> like, yeah, fuck you. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> no, they were the Confederate flags with a truck in it. Oh, um, yeah, they're like fucking like art department. Yeah, just trying to fucking think. All right, guys, we got we got, <laughs> yeah. we got a couple weeks to ballpark this. So what are we thinking? Like. I'm thinking three to five different flags. You know, yeah. about five to ten plants in there too. We're gonna like, put some Nazi one on a truck and that, just have it parked somewhere. Yeah, roll yeah, through. Weird like business of like, like influencing, putting like yeah, it's all bullshit. Yeah, planting seeds in places. Yeah, there, there were probably people handing out flyers or some shit and those things too. Have you? Is no one ever watched that Jake Gyllenhaal movie where you like, or like heard about the all these classic cases of like you know the. What I forget what the complex is called or whatever, but the fireman who likes to start fires to go put them out, right? And like the yeah. news people that create the stories to, to, re- to report about them. Yeah, like these. Okay, guys. Okay, yeah. Nobody is doing that. Fucking nobody threw just the fucking hand. Nobody was like, "Hey, go disturb some shit at this thing. We'll make a story out of it." Nobody did that. No. No, not ever. Oh my like, god! Like not even people like you're literally like prank. Americans. No people, no people trying to like interview and shit. all over the world. A, it, it's being. Broadcast all over the world. Not a single other country is entertaining the fact that these people could be racist for one thing, or whatever. They think yeah. they're Canadians. Everyone's like, "Look at these Canadians." Yeah, that's wait, it. Wait, Canadians are still locked down. Literally, I listened to a podcast on American comedians where right off the bat he was like, "Have they called them racist yet?" Because that's what they do. They call them racist. When, when white people protest, they call them racist. When black people protest, they call them violent. Like it's what they do. It's what the media does to spin the fucking narratives. It's fucking bullshit. Man, and people people buy into those. They're just all like, the time. Yep, all the time. Me, give me all of them. That's give what me I everything. mean. This is what we were saying about trigger happy. Everyone's been isolated and hasn't been communicating. We've all got really and good. Because they're isolated, they're easily Everyone's influenced. got really good at being oh, able to just stuff. tweet. We're getting and conspiracy repost. theory territory, Matt, because we're isolated. We're more susceptible to being 
No, I think we manipulated. No, I think we've all just got really good at being able to just like retweet things and do things on our phone, like share, 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 because like that's all we people were doing for a while, right? Yeah, but more than ever, I should say. Then you get caught in the algorithm of sharing with only what exactly. You share. That's the point. Confirmation bias. Like all the same people. You fuck. We're posting all the same things. It's not a coincidence. Like the same memes about the neo. If I showed up at that, I saw a flat or whatever it is. The same one saying it was racist. Like they were all sharing the same things. It's because of the algorithm. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking wild. No man. one listened this far anyway. So no one listened worry. this far. We're, we're, and if you did, thank you. No, it, it's and it, you know what? Call us way, dumb. Yeah. I don't care. Yes. I'm dumb. Air out your shit. Air it out. Sam's dumber. I am pretty dumb. <laughs> hey, f- fuck you, pal. I'm fucking <laughs> just about as dumb as everybody else here. All right. I got to pee, dog. All right. Let's well, take it easy. All right. Yeah. See uh, you guys. See you guys. Till next episode. Yep, um, that was 104. Yeah. Maybe hope you, Sam, hope you, we were maybe Sam will do something with his wall. Yes, I am. He probably won't, though. I'll start my lava lamp next time, too. All right. Um, peace. <laughs> I'm leaving. Peace. All right.